Young Lamar Jimerson went to France in 1917 with the American Expeditionary Forces, serving first with the balloon section, stumbling about in open fields, holding one end of a long rope, and then later as a telephone switchboard operator at AEF headquarters in Chaumont. It was there, on the banks of the Marne River, that he first came to hear of the Noman Society. He was walking about Chaumont one night with his hands in his pockets when he was approached by a dark, bow-legged man who offered to trade a small book for two packages of old gold cigarettes. The book had to do with the interpretation of dreams. Corporal Jimerson did not smoke, nor did he have much interest in such a book, but he felt sorry for the ragged fellow and so treated him to a good supper at the Hotel Davos. The man wept, overcome with gratitude. He said his name was Nick and that he was an Albanian refugee from Turkey. After supper, he revealed that his real name was Mike and that he was actually a Greek from Alexandria in Egypt. The dream book was worthless, he said, full of extravagant lies, and he apologized for imposing in such a way on the young soldier. He apologized, too, for his body odor, saying that nerve sweat or fear sweat made for a stronger stink than mere work sweat or heat sweat, or at least that had been his experience, and that he was always nervous when he spoke of delicate matters.